It is not easy to be an astronaut or a cosmonaut. It's a process that takes a long time, and the person who is willing to be should have lots of courage and hard work. You may have seen the astronauts who performing spacewalks in some instances. How they practice these things on Earth. Is there any place to practice spacewalks? So let's have a look at that marvelous place. If you are the first time visiting our channel make sure to subscribe and hit on the bell icon to watch more interesting videos. The Neutral Buoyancy Lab is located in the Johnson Space Center, Texas. Here the astronauts are performing simulated EVA tasks for spacewalks in a microgravity environment. So if you or don't know the term EVA, it stands for extravehicular activities, which any activity is done by the astronauts or the cosmonauts outside a spacecraft beyond the Earth's atmosphere. The pool is 62 meters in length, 31 meters wide and 12.3 meters deep. The most impressive fact about this huge pool is, it holds 6.2 million gallons of water. That means 23.5 million liters. Because of that reason, it has been the world's largest indoor pool in the world. There is a full mock-up of the International Space Station located at the bottom of the pool. If you want to know the evolution of the space stations, click on the card displaying on the screen right now. There are some structures of visiting vehicles that are operating to supply the payloads to the space station. HTV belongs to JAXA, ATV belongs to European Space Agency, SpaceX Dragon Capsule, and the Cygnus Capsule. Both the Space Shuttle Bay and the Hubble Space Telescope have been removed because they are not needed longer for training. The trainees wear a suit designed to provide neutral buoyancy to simulate the microgravity that astronauts experience during the spacewalks. Cameras are placed all over the pool so that the safety of the trainees and the tasks that they perform could be monitored easily. When an object's average density is equal to the density at the fluid in which it is immersed, resulting in buoyant force balances the gravity. That is the main reason that microgravity has developed inside the pool. So that the astronaut will neither rise nor sink. Now we have come to the end of this video, and if you enjoyed make sure to subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. Thank you.